What's up you guys? This is Junior Trader and in this video we are taking a look at Mara stock. So let's do the price action analysis and let's identify the important key levels on the price action as is this pivot as it's forming does it confirm a good upside coming on Mara and what are those levels it can go all the way up to and this is also a follow-up on the trade that I opened on Mara and I have done this video. Check this out on my channel. You will learn there as well what made me go into this play, the long play. And then um, today it is giving me another confirmation to the upside. So I take partial profits out, right? So first position of partial profits was 22.69. My stop loss was below this pivot point. It never went in that stop loss region. You will see throughout this video the reasoning behind that and also this today's candle, what does it confirms to me now and what are the more upside that I'm targeting on this. So with that, we'll cover all that stuff in this video. I also want to let you know that none of this is any financial advice. This is only for education purposes. I'm only sharing my opinion, how I trade the market, how I read the market. You are solely responsible for your own financial decisions and outcomes. I'm not here to tell you what you have to do. I take guarantee of nothing and this is just my opinion on what I'm doing with the market. So now with Mara guys this first of all this background green box that you are seeing which I want to change the color of actually because so this box is actually a, a zone and an area where Mara has reacted a lot for the last 10 years. If you have been seeing my videos you already know that. But for anyone who is coming in new, I just want to quickly show that as well. This is the resistance, resistance just around that blue box, right? Then we have this trying to form the support here, support back here. And like I can go back 10 years, guys, in the history of Mara, and you will see the most price reactions here. Resistance, right? Support. And I can keep going back and back, guys, till 10 years. And this is the zone you would see the most as the acted upon support or resistance. Now, our thesis was going into this play as Mara was continuing to fall. We had this trend line over here on the daily interval with pivot, pivot points, strong pivot points here, three times tested. And what I wanted to see is a confirmation back into this trend line. And when I started to see this some support and consolidation hold below that trend line, our thesis was let's wait and watch for the break of structure, which I'll show you in just a second on hourly interval. And we entered this long play and then we were targeting these levels to the upside. Now with that, um, let's go to the hourly interval. Just before that, I just want to show you this is a confirmed pivot point already on Mara that we have formed in a newly formed uptrend. You can see higher highs higher lows these are your higher lows and this is your higher high and what we want to see is a continuation of this to make another higher high so let's go to the hourly interval and let's talk about talk through the things here so where we are so what was the break of structure and guys what i'm going to do actually is i'm going to turn off the intraday level so that only significant levels are shown so the chart is a little bit cleaner because we only need significant levels for this video purpose so what we were watching is um, this zone um, of around $19.25 to the zone of $19.19 and I think intraday levels I'll have to turn it on because I want to show you something yeah and with that came this one of the levels. So this was the zone I was watching for the break of structure because it was holding a good support down here. And at the same time, this was the structure as it was building, right? Um, a resistance again of the previous low pivot, previous pivot. And once we broke out of it again, it, will, it was supposed to put us back in this blue box above this trend line from the daily interval right around here right and also breaking the structure of the downtrend with the possible double bottom so you can see there was just so much 80 to 90 percent confluence building of the long play there so this was my entry break into this level above this uh trend line and this was the swing play i took the first take profit target was this level um 22.66 cents took 
so, you know, I you know I partially size out. I like to do that, and so took the profits there, and then we did you know come lower, and then we were watching that. Hey, it's not bearish yet. This was the stop loss is down here. It never went into our stop loss zone. Yeah, so guys, we were watching this trend line to break then, and then we got that upside, and we never broke into the stop loss zone area. So, and we kept holding that trend line into this blue box, previously being the green box, but blue box now. And today, it just marks another confirmation that it is still holding that 200 hours moving average, this trend line, blue box, holding that pivot, the demand zone from here, right? Multiple times tested demand zone. That's where our entry zone was, the demand zone entry. And um, this is, today has marked a pivot down here on the daily interval that I showed you. And yes, it has room to continue to go up. My remaining position that I have open 50% that is left on this, I plan on $25.30 is the what I'm targeting. That's where I see the next strong resistance, but I definitely want to see it break out of $22.81. And accordingly, I'll size in, size out based on the price action. But then, yes, as we continue to do this, we are again forming this uptrend on Mara, same place around the same support good box. And we just have to follow through the uptrend and take partial profits throughout the journey. So the position that I have had I'm still having that just 50% of it, 50% as I told, I've already closed in profit here, $22.60 somewhere. Yep, and yep, so I would highly suggest you check out my videos on Mara that I have done on my channel. You can just go and search on my channel and that will give you all this background context of when I did, took this play, you know, how I did that and all of that. Now, going back to the daily interval, Things are looking good to me on Mara, guys, to be honest. Um, the, this Today's green candle is really good. It, As I said, it shows us a uptrend already with the pivot form. So this is awesome to see. Let's see how high it continues. As you know, nothing is guaranteed in stock market. I, and I also don't take guarantee of anything. And I know there is a guarantee of nothing. That's why I have stop losses. I size in, size out, you know, move my position around. And accordingly, I do that. Okie dokie. Um, yeah, so definitely this is the next level breakout we want to see. $22.79 due to this pivotal resistance on the daily interval and also the recent one. But yeah, this uptrend as it's confirming with a really good candle, I expect upside. Just my opinion though. Uh, dashboard is also fully bullish, so that's great as well to see. Alrighty guys, and also if you need access to my tools, links are in the description below of this video, okay? I also did videos on um, NVIDIA arm yeah well arm smci check all those out on my channel tesla is looking great i'll do it in afternoon as well and all this stuff guys wow netflix is selling off today i read it i'll do that as well today all this good stuff guys hit the subscribe button and like and i'll see my next video take care bye